Okay guys, if you have been chilling on the internet, you have seen this girl, this lady, this woman, whatever she wants to be called. She, for whatever reason, thought to take the card from her Tesla, dissolve the card away, take the inner guts, and then implant it into her, her arm. So, there's a million reasons why that's a bad idea, in my opinion. But we're not even going to talk about, like, just the idea of putting something inside your body. Like, that's not even my place to discuss. This idea is just kind of beyond stupid to me for a bunch of reasons. The first reason is that this card that this girl dissolved... This is the backup method to get into your car. This is not the main method for getting into your car. You know the main method for getting into your car? It is the device that you carry with you all the time. And you know what? This is also the device that has all the features for your car. So how you can remote start it, how you can set the air condition, how you can turn off the alarm system, how you can check the battery. Everything is right here. There's no reason that you wouldn't use this all the time. Not to mention, when you use your phone, you don't even have to think about it. Your car unlocks and locks when you walk up to it and go away. The key card that this girl implanted into herself is the backup thing. So that means when you get into your car, you have to tap the pillar to get in. And then you have to tap down here. And according to her, she said that as of right now, it does work, but the range is about an inch. So look at this. So to start your car, your Tesla, you have to put your card right there. I don't know. It just seems like very, very like hard. So if my implant is like right there, which I don't remember where she put it, but it's in her forearm. So I would have to like, like... It would be hard to do it. Maybe you could do your arm this way to turn the car on, but then if you have a person in your passenger seat, you're like getting all up in their space. If you want to do it this way, like to get it right perfectly, your arm doesn't even bend that way. I don't know. It may just be me, but again, I think it's a stupid idea. I get why she did it because this is probably just what she's into. It's just like how some people like tattoos and some people don't. She likes injecting technology into her body that serves a substandard purpose. Was that even like a correct phrase or word? I don't know. And a lot of people do comment, um, what happens if you get a new car? What happens if you sell your car? What happens if you get another Tesla? What happens if you have two Teslas? That's not an issue at all. Like That's a big thing with Tesla. You can reprogram your card to work with other cars, new cars. You can have multiple cards for multiple cars. Not a big deal. But just overall, I think the idea just isn't there. Until we are done being dependent on our phones, this idea just doesn't make sense to me. Basically, when you go out in public, if you go driving, you're required to keep your driver's license on you. So why not just keep this Tesla card in the same spot as your driver's license. Like until th the world is fully digital and until some point where we're all implanted with stuff that keeps track of our social and our ID and our money, this doesn't really serve much purpose. But this definitely could be the future. But the future is not right now. And that's all I got to say about that, guys. Let me know what you think about this in the comment section below. It's right below that thumbs up button. Have a great day. See you later. Bye.